this out. It's going haywire. It's milligauze. EMF. Right here at this CT area. Okay? Now, I'm going to turn this off because it's kind of annoying. But I'm going to tell you something right now. Uh, could this be why a seven hour audio file, okay, that has got every single thing, that every single noise that, that you can imagine being picked up on July 9th, 2014, okay? On July 9th, 2014, I was brutally assaulted at this area. Everything was caught on audio file. The, the assault was caught on video file, okay? Now let's, let's take a look at this. A seven hour tape recorder, a seven hour, a seven hour audio file was running. Now, right as soon as the police arrive on the scene, after I start talking to them and, and, and describe the assault, I then took out another phone that's got literal audio proof that I'm being gang stalked. And as soon as I booted that phone on, within a couple of minutes, the audio file, you could hear nothing, but it was still recording. Okay? Nothing at all. You could not hear nothing in reference to what was recorded, but the audio file was still recording. Okay? A seven hour audio file has got every single thing, every background noise, bird chirping, the assault, what happened when the police got here, the 911 call, me talking to the police, and then as soon as I boot up that other phone that's got a, a copied section of some audio harassment of open gang stalking, and then went to go play him back, guess what happened? The tape recorder stopped recording audio. It went blank. It still recorded, but it went blank. Now. I just showed you what. Extra low frequency millimeter waves. Okay. Do gang stalking expeditions have technology that can hijack into any electronic device to control the functions of it? Okay. Or edit, alter, or delete any information in it? Yes, they do. Thank you.